Hey, what's up, YouTubers? Uh, it's your boy, I take you, I got here with another video. Now, this video is my um, top um, favorite Android 6.0 Marshmallow features, and we're going to go ahead and get into it. Now, this is not really a big overhaul change in the Android system, but mainly enhancements and improvements and things that, you know, we should have gotten a long time ago instead of rooting your device just to get a few of these features, excluding the Google Now and the Dose. But it's a lot of features and functions that should have just been implemented already, but Google's finally catching on. Um, let me dim down the brightness. Sorry if it looks too dim or whatnot. But okay, guys, we're going to get into it. Now, um, first new feature enhancement I'm going to discuss is the system UI tuner. Now system UI tuner, uh, how you get it, uh, I think I showed this in the first video of my uh, hands on, but you hold down uh, the gear and wrench it, you hold down the gear for like five seconds and then let go and then it will um, basically send you directly down here to the bottom and it says you unlock this system UI um, tuner. So. Um, and now in this feature you will have um, basically quick settings and this will allow you to change how you toggle, how your icons look on the toggles, which toggles you want, you can delete, you can add and it just gives you a little freedom of customization of the toggle drop down as you can see. Okay, now you can also change the status bar too so you could turn off all the icons you can turn them off and then it'll look like less clutter up at the top or you can turn them on and you know have it your way and you can also put in the percentage um, the percentage um, battery and you just turn it on and turn it off if you want to see the percentage inside the icon and that's pretty much it for the system UI now the next feature function is basically going to be Google Now and Tap now you just hold that down and it usually gives you information. So I'm going ahead to uh, do a little example. Let's see if I can get something about Intel on Twitter. So we're going to go ahead and see if we get information. Um, I guess it was too broad. So let's see if I can go ahead and scroll and use it on the main page. Now as you can see, I got a little more information um, based on uh, products and stocks and things like that okay so that's what Google now on tap it just gives you further information on um, what's on your actual screen uh, now the next uh, function is dose now I really can't show this on the screen but dose it usually works it usually works like if I'm not um, using my battery or screen as much um, you'll be able to see um, breaks or if it's not in use and things like that so it'll let you know how how much longer you have without use and that's a pretty cool feature uh, next feature is app permissions now app permissions it gives you full function full control over the apps that you have um, how you want your apps to work how you want your apps to run um, do you want your apps to use camera mode do you want your apps to use uh, microphone, your contacts, your location. So now you have full control of your apps and how they are being used inside the actual system. All right. Now this next function is this feature is really not a big deal, but you can um, use the volume controls. Now you have volume, you have full function of your volume control. You have it on notifications, your sounds, um, your alarm. So now you can change all that within your volume rocker. Alright, and um, this last decent one is the disturb uh, button, the icon. You have more control over how you, you want your priorities, or and you, you can customize it too. Just go to more settings in your disturb uh, menu, and you can automatically rule, and you can even add new rules to how you want your um, disturb mode to actually work. So that's a pretty good deal. Now, last but not least, we're going to go ahead and get into this uh, Android Marshmallow uh, Easter Egg. Now, you go to your About Phone section. Then you go to the Android version, which is 6.0, and you just tap on that. And then you will get this incredible, cool, mini demo game of 
uh, Flappy Birds, but it's it's Marshmallow. So, and it's really not that hard to play. It's just it's more of focus. And of course, you got the big Marshmallow heads, and they can get in the way sometimes. But this overall, it's it's it's, it's a very good experience, like like no other. And to be honest, you you are missing out if you don't have Android Marshmallow. And that's just my um, take on uh, the new UI, the new enhancements and improvements to Android Marshmallow. I have the Nexus 6, of course, and it was one of the first to get the updates, if, if you didn't know. Uh, usually, Android um, new system updates go on the Nexus first. And, yeah, so let me know your thoughts, which one uh, features or functions that I did not mention that you want to see. Um... Did you like any other new features or functions? Are you on Android 6 point on Marshmallow? Are you rooting, modding, however you want? You know, leave a comment below, share the video, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content like this, and have a good day. Peace.